Solomon. Ellie Mimiam is here to deliver gifts, but before we go there, are we going to see you guys in training camp this year? Hopefully, hopefully we do. Uh, you know, go to training camp, and you know, hopefully, you know, obviously the whole strike thing. The CBA talks are ongoing Wednesday. Hopefully that gets resolved because, you know, I love playing football and we have great fans, so we like to get that resolved as fast as possible. How does that change your routine right now, knowing that there are some question marks right. with the league? Are you still pushing forward, trying to get ready yeah. for June 20th? Yeah, it doesn't change for us athletes. You know, we have a job to do, and that's to get ready for, you know, June 20th, which is our home opener. Um, you know, so recently, last Saturday, we actually did a gross grind. How'd that go? That was tough. That was actually, <laughs> actually a grind, so, you know. I've only ever done it once. Yeah. I did once, and that might be my last time doing Give me it. Yeah, I thought. I'm each time out. You, you tweeted this photo, and I'm like, okay, this is how intense the training is for the BC Lions. Get a load of this, because uh, you see Solomon here looking like Bane from Batman in this photo here. I'm like, what is going on yeah. here? Yeah. That's actually, um, you know, the hills that we found. Me and my teammate, uh, Emmanuel Arsenal, we found that last Thursday. Excuse me, last Wednesday. And we just thought it'd be cool to try something new. So right now, what I got on is elevation mask, and it's supposed to be um, similar high altitude really? you know, so that's supposed to get your cardio going and obviously we have camp you know hopefully this week uh, next weekend so yeah. you know just trying to you know try different things and get that cardio going and just you know get ref ready for the season make it feel like you're playing a mile high every day so when you play at BC place you're like whatever yeah easy comes natural okay tell us what's in the box of course I had to bring some presents you know um, in the box there are season tickets for you guys so you know I want to thank you guys for all your work and sweet, sweet. Got some season tickets for you guys so we got, there's we, a twist with this we've though, got right? season tickets so we're going to give away a pair of tickets for every home game over the course of the season right here on BT so it's like a weekly giveaway mm -hmm. and you've got in here a 10 pack for the home opener yes so what are we going to do with those we're giving away that's your chance to play one last chance to get in on that we're going to do that one at 805 so keep watching for that chance home opener bring your friends we're hearing it's the salute to fans for that home opener how was the energy last year and how important is that for you guys on the field to keep the momentum going with the team uh it's really important you know i just heard some they were 16 and 2 at home you know so obviously the crowd the fans are a big part of that so we want to keep that going and keep the energy flowing and um you know we just want all the fans to come out we had a fan appreciation um ticket season holder event yesterday where we had about three four thousand fans come out and it was awesome got a chance to sign autographs and meet a lot of great fans serious depth at quarterback now with the acquisition of terry glenn as well yeah yeah you know what and obviously you know you play 18 games, that's a long season. Yeah. And obviously 20 when you come to playoffs, you need, you know, good backup quarterbacks. And um, Kevin's a guy who's Sorry, done Kevin. it. Kevin, I said Terry. <laughs> I was thinking astronaut. Yeah. Kevin, so Kevin Glenn, he's a very talented quarterback. Very I'm going to be backing up Travis Lule, we think. Yeah. Heading into camp. You know, Travis is a guy. You know, Travis is our quarterback, and everybody knows that. And Kevin's job is to come in here and, and support him. And, you know, obviously Travis is, is getting, you know, coming off a of shoulder, sure, shoulder surgery. surgery. So, he, you know, he's been going at it aggressively, rehabbing, trying to get back on the field. And hopefully, you know, we will see uh, Travis, the home opener. And, um, you know, obviously Kevin is a big part of, you know, what we're trying to do. He's um, going to provide competition and, you know, just support. So it's great to have Kevin on the team. Two veterans, a quarterback. Just coming back home? This we year. have to. We have to bring back home. Obviously, we started the, the recent trend of, you know, winning it at home in 2011. So we want to finish the uh, finish the thing off right. So it's nice shiny. Yeah, One of the single point. greatest sporting experiences is going and, and witnessing Grey Cup live anywhere, but live on home turf when your team wins. That's something extra special. So hopefully this is, we can give some good mojo with the gifts you've brought today. Send our viewers down there. Definitely. Powerful box right there. Thanks for bringing the tickets. Good luck to you. Hopefully everything gets sorted. June 20th, home opener. And again, 8.05, final chance to play. You and nine friends, you could be winning that ultimate prize. Checking out the home opener salute to fans. Thanks for waking up early, too. Uh, thanks for having me. Really and appreciate it. I apologize to Kevin for me. <laughs> I will definitely <laughs>